teacher. Uh, let's have a look at today's beautiful piece. Non nobis domine non nobis. Not unto us, O Lord, but unto thy name be the glory. Uh, and it is a very, very simple part. Now, on, on this score here, um, you can see A, B, C. And that's literally all we need to learn. A, B, and C for each part. Now, the mezzo-soprano line, which is really soprano line for everybody, um, we'll learn that all together. Then there's a tenor part. Now, the tenor part actually is also suitable for altos. And it's the same tune. It's just down a fourth. And then the bass part is the same as the soprano part, but down a full octave. Okay, and then they're sung, as you can see, coming in one after the other. Um, and you end up with this lovely sort of flowing counterpoint. Polyphony, many voices, poly, many um, phony sound. Okay, so let me just put this into the right key, because we're not going to sing it in this key. We're going to put it up a tone. So those of you with perfect pitch, we're doing this in C major. So the first line is literally just this first three bars here, and everyone can sing this. We sing, non nobis domine, non nobis. Everybody with me? And non nobis domine, non nobis. Very, very nice. Just be careful as you're rising up the scale. Remember to smile. Non nobis tom. So we get all the way to that note. And then when you're coming down, just be really careful where you have semitones. There's a semitone. And then whole tones. Just be careful you know which is which, just so it doesn't go flat on the way down. So one more time, everybody, since we all sing this, sing with me. And non nobis domine, non nobis. Okay, so that's the A part. You then have a rest, literally one beat. It's uh, nobis, sed nomini tu, od agnoniam. With me, sed nomini tu, od agnoniam, gloniam. Ignore what I did there on the piano. So sing with me again. Sed nomini, three, four, one. Sed nomini tu, od agnoniam. Excellent. Uh, just a couple of things there. So when you're seeing gloriam, can you can you give that an extra syllable? Gloriam. So tu da gloriam. Use the g to kind of set up some pressure behind your tongue. So gloriam. And so it sort of launches the sound. All right. So let's sing. Said nomini tu da gloriam. And one. Said nomini tu da gloriam. Excellent. So from the beginning, non nobis, two, three, four, non nobis, domine, non nobis, sed nomini tu, ad agloniam. Excellent. So you've learned A and B, and this remember this is the soprano and the bass part. So bass is non nobis, domine, non nobis. That is your part. You just start it later on. So we have C to learn for the sopranos and the basses. And again, this one's after one. We sing one. Sed nomini tu ad agloniam. And one. Sed nomini tu ad agloniam. And then we start on the beat of the next bar. Non nobis domine non nobis. And we're back at the beginning. We're round and round. So let's sing A, B, C, A, B, C. Let's do it all the way through twice, please, everybody. And those who are in the alto part, you're learning it. It's just your line will be starting lower in a minute. Okay, so non nobis, everybody. Two, three, and non nobis, domine, non nobis. Sed nomini tu, ad agloniam. Sed nomini tu, ad agloniam. Non nobis, domine, non nobis. Sed nomini tu, ad agloniam. Sed nomini tu, Dagloniam non nobis domine non nobis. 
that's it. And we go around three times. When we get to the end of the third time, we literally sing that first A phrase again. And then the piece comes to an end. Well done, everybody. Okay, so that's the soprano line. It's also the bass line, as we'll discover in a minute. Now, altos and tenors. It is the same line, except it starts a fourth lower. So let's all sing this, whichever octave you like. So be careful, sopranos, if you're going to follow that pitch. Because it's going up there in a minute. Okay, so you might want to have a go at singing it down uh, with the tenors and the altos. To Three, four, one, two. Non nobis domine non nobis, sed nomini tota gloriam, sed nomini tota gloriam, non nobis domine non nobis. There we are. Okay, so it is the same uh, same as the soprano and bass part, except it is uh, down a fourth. Let's do that one more time, altos and tenors. Okay, because the tricky thing with this isn't actually singing the line. It's singing with everybody else singing at the same time. That's the tricky bit. So let's do this through twice, uh, tenors and altos. I hope everyone's singing along. All right, because the more you sing it, the more it goes in. Ready? Two, three, four, one, two. Non nobis domine non nobis, sed nomini tota gloriam, sed nomini tota gloriam, non nobis domine Sed nomini tota gloriam, sed nomini tota gloriam, non nobis domine non nobis. So at the end of your three times through, we sing it three times. Uh, and then at the end of the third time, you just sing non nobis domine non nobis one more time. And that's the end for you. OK, so the way this works is sopranos come in on the first beat. Uh, uh, so it's, it's actually it moves quite quickly. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that kind of tempo. So it's non nobis domine non. OK, so the, the altos come in uh, a, a beat effectively after the sopranos and the basses come in three beats after the sopranos okay so what we're going to do we're going to sing along with the recording that i've got over here okay multi-tracked by yours truly three bends um and let's give it a try we'll sing this one on sunday without doubt uh, as part of our sacred sing and it's one that i'm going to be bringing back fairly regularly and we'll sing it at the, at the start of our chorus sessions um i've got quite a few like this actually nice short little pieces um, I feel like singing a bit of, uh, maybe a bit of Fair Phyllis I saw sitting all alone in a couple of weeks. Um, or April is in my mistress face, some really beautiful Renaissance part songs. But let's sing this one. So I'll give you the notes and uh, and then we'll sing it through everybody. So have some fun with this one. So here we go. Here are notes. And. Non hobbies, 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 Sopranos, altos, basses, sops, altos, basses. How do you get on, folks? How was that? Bearing in mind that it's a very simple line, but it just takes a couple of times through for you to find your bearings. 
let's have one more go at that okay because i know there are people out there who are just shaking their heads at the moment that no no that didn't work for me well let's try it one more time okay so we start with the sopranos here and it is quite brisk isn't it Sops straight away altos come in on the next strong beat okay and as soon as you start just just keep going okay i will bring you in i'll i'll call out sopranos here altos here what i think i'll do this time is I'm going to sing with the altos because you're buried in the sound, altos and tenors. Um, I'll let the, the, the soprano bend and the bass bend do, do their thing. All right. So those of you that are sops and basses, you can sing with them. And I'm going to sing alto and tenor this time through. All right, everyone. So let's give this one more go. I'll give you the notes again. Here we go. Soprano, alto, and... Okay, thank you everybody. I hope